Good morning and afternoon and welcome to Steel City News. Now the Pittsburgh Steelers had a difficult loss on Sunday and the chances for the playoffs are getting slimmer and slimmer. And at this point it's looking at their chance to make the playoffs is now under 1%. Now, if the Pittsburgh Steelers would win every game from here on out, the chances could be anywhere from four to maybe 6% chance of making the playoffs. And a lot of that making of the playoffs would have to do with a lot of other teams failing in their games and straight out losing. So you depend on a lot of other teams to lose. So the chances are very slim, but a chance is still a chance. It's not impossible. It's very close to impossible. It's right there at the line of impossible. But, you know, Mitch Trubisky has some hope to make the playoffs, but he does say what everybody says. We're just focusing game by game. And of course, as a professional football player, you are going to focus game by game because you have a lot of studying to do for this next upcoming game. This is what Mitch Trubisky had to say after the game on Sunday. So you guys obviously didn't have a like, big chance at the playoffs, but you had some hope and you had some wins and you were building something. How do you feel like the feeling of the team is right now after this loss? And is that hope still there? There's always hope. We just take it one day at a time and continue to take care of business. So um, we, we had a, definitely had a huge opportunity today. We know that. Um, but we put our head down and go back to work. Um, and we got a good group of guys. Uh, we got leaders emerging. Um, the chemistry is, it has been building over the course of the season. So we just continue to stick together, put our heads down and work, and go get one next week. That was Mitch Mitchell Trubisky speaking to the media after the game on Sunday. He had to come in there after Kenny Pickett went out for concussion protocol. We have no new news on Kenny Pickett and his concussion protocol. That's going to go on day by day throughout this week. And, you know, one thing that did concern me was when Coach Tomlin mentioned after the game about symptoms. And that's when he was taken back out of the game. So that that's not a good thing to hear about symptoms. But we're going to have to see how this week unfolds to know if there is going to be a need for a backup quarterback to step up for Sunday. Will it be Mitch Trubisky? Will it be Mason Rudolph? Right now, it looks likely to be Mitch Trubisky. We're going to learn more Tuesday at Coach Tomlin's press conference. And remember, if you want up-to-date Pittsburgh Steelers news, information, talk, and analysis, you can subscribe right here to our YouTube channel. Definitely appreciate that. Hit that bell if you want notifications. Thanks for watching.